Hey guys, it's Kelly and welcome back to our channel. For today's video, I'm doing a stay-at-home mom day in the life. Um, today is Monday the 22nd. I have not vlogged in a while. I fully didn't mean to forget to vlog for like over a week, but um, I did. So um, I am vlogging today and just going to be showing you guys my day it is currently 11 15 um late start to the day um i've been sleeping in i haven't felt the best i mean i'm not like sick or anything i just tmi have a really bad postpartum period so yeah um so i've been dealing with that for the past week right now i'm gonna do my makeup i've been trying to get ready every day um, most days, obviously, that doesn't really work out, and that's fine, but I've been trying to, like, do my makeup, this is the second day of doing my makeup, like, trying to get dressed, and just feel a little bit better about myself, um, so I'm sure if you guys are stay-at-home moms, it's hard to feel like a functioning human when you're still in your pajamas. Well, I guess you don't have to be a stay-at-home mom, but for that, but if you don't do much, it's kind of hard to feel like a functioning human being. I don't really feel like doing much makeup today, so I'm just gonna put some bronzer on and I have to do my eyebrows. That's a must. Bronzer on, eyebrows, and mascara, which should be good. Good to go. Um, I use the Essence bronzer. Not that huge of a fan of it. Um, if you guys like any bronzers, let me know down below because I don't know. Also, I'm planning on getting my hair done. Um, I don't really know what I want done. Um, I feel like I want balayage. I was originally thinking like silver balayage but um i don't know if you can tell because my hair just looks dark i actually have like reddish tints in my hair and um anytime i like bleach my hair it becomes more red um so like anytime i've gotten my hair done like balayage with blonde it just turns red and i don't love that but yeah, if any of you guys have any suggestions on what to do with my hair, let me know because I hate my hair and I just want something new. Also, I don't know if I said this, but Brendan is downstairs with Finn. Finn's not by himself. He's only five months old, so. I mean, I do leave him to get ready in the day, but not for long because he usually needs to be with me. Okay, that's all for my makeup. Um, one thing. I love this mascara. If you are ever looking for a mascara, it's the CoverGirl Professional 3-in-1 Waterproof. Um, I don't think it matters if you get waterproof or not, but... Um, I actually found that from TikTok where my mom uses the one that's like the curve one. The curve one. This is like the straightening one. I'm not a huge volume person for for mascara because of my glasses, but I like the lengthening because anytime I ever use like volumizing mascaras, it gets all over my glasses, so yeah. All right, we're gonna go downstairs and do some stuff. Also, tell me if you like this angle because I feel like it's very convenient that I can like come in here into the bathroom and get ready and vlog. Um, I never had that with any other place that I've ever lived. We are gonna go downstairs and also I got this new Apple Watch band. She print like six dollars on Amazon so. Okay we are downstairs. Let's show the baby. That's Finny. That's Finny. Keep was it. Look that's Finny. Mr. He's so sleepy. But yeah, what are we doing today? 
Nothing. Nothing. Go for a walk. Um, we're going to clean up the house because the house is a mess. We had to do a lot of laundry. We had to play with Mr. Vinny. We do. And yeah, um, I really want coffee, so I'm gonna go make coffee. I like coffee. Thanks. Mm. What do we have for breakfast, man? Pizza. Pizza. We're gonna have pizza for breakfast because we had pizza last night. It feels so weird to be vlogging on my camera again because if you haven't watched any of my other vlogs, I've been using my phone for way too long. Way too long. But yeah, if you've been watching any of my videos, you know that I have not been using my camera. Not too sure why I haven't been using it, but I haven't. I've been using my phone. I'm gonna make a coffee. Um, I'm psychotic and I drink iced coffee. Now that it's like 40 degrees, it doesn't really make sense, but it's fine. Um, I'm gonna make a coffee. Just pretend that the kitchen is clean, please. Okay, so I just finished my coffee. You guys saw that. Um, this is what I made. It is a two shots of Starbucks espresso and then um, caramel drizzle and vanilla fat-free creamer. It is yummy. Okay, Brendan won't try my drink. I tried it. You didn't try it. I just put it in my mouth. It was gross. You put the straw in your mouth and went. I had a little bit touch my tongue. It was gross. Yeah. Okay. All right. Next. Yeah. This cup is from my friend Kylie. Kylie, if you're watching this, thank you for the cup. I still use it. Um, I really want another one because I feel like this one's always dirty and I always want like a second coffee. Mood, Finn, mood. And then we're gonna clean and then we're gonna go food shopping because we need groceries, but I need to eat before we go because I am already hangry. Oh, bless you. Oh, bless you. Did you sneeze? That was a cute sneeze. It was. All right, I'm gonna update you guys in a little bit because I have nothing to say. What is going on? We're here in Finney's room. Mr. Finney just got a new diaper. I don't think we've shown uh, his room. Who is that? Is that Finney? Mm -hmm. Who is that? Do you see Mr. Finney there? Look at that baby right there. Who is that guy? He's a cutie, isn't he? He's very serious. All right, let's check out Finney's room. Let's start over here. So, there's Kelly and Finn. If you walk in, at the door here, we hang his towel up there. It's not very wide. Well, we put stuff to hang on the doors. There are all those extra diapers, and those are pictures. Those are, oh, I'm off. So there's pictures, extra wipes. Pictures? These oh. are all extra stuff. There's clothes hanging up there, and then there's more storage up there here's his crib <laughs> from Ikea. The Ikea crib with the Newton baby mattress, Newton baby mattress. we so really like it it fits well in there we took a couple naps in there we're not sure what to do with this corner yet we have we moved his hatch into this room and then we have this, this used to be an Ikea step stool and we painted it so now it's kind of like an end table because it's a good height for this chair but this chair doesn't really recline in this corner and it comes out really far into the room 
It's a very tiny room. They're thin. Wait, do you mean like how it is right now? It comes out far? No, to. Oh, to recline. If you were to recline it, it would come out further. Hi. This is the small Hemnez dresser from IKEA. So we had the really bigger nice one. Fit. Yeah, we had the bigger one, but this one fits nicer in this small room. I also really like the white. We have some bookshelves up here. I have like leather handles for this. I haven't found them yet since we moved. They're somewhere in the back of the room. We have this wicker basket. They <laughs> thrift it. Got it in San Diego, so that's his laundry. laundry basket. We have his books on these IKEA bookshelves, and then we have the IKEA spice, rack. spice racks for more books that go all the way up, and then some decor, decor and baby fin up there. Mirror right above his changing table. It's from Jimmy's. And this is a skip hop pad. And then we have the Ubi wipes container, which just have wet wipes in it, and then the Ubi trash can. Ubi trash can in the corner. Do you like it? The Ubi trash can? Yeah, I like the trash can. And then this is... We'll go through the diapers. drawers if you want. There's diapers, wipes, some medicine, some lotion. This is free to baby stuff. This is like hair and nails. This thing. I love that thing. The free to baby, like multi tool. Kelly uses this thing all the time. I pick at them. You like. So like picking their ears and their nose. This one's for their fingernails and their hands, and then this is just everything. General purpose pick. Kelly likes to pick Finn's ears and stuff. And then this is the one she lost for a while, but this is the Oogie Bear. Oogie Bear one. Honestly, that thing is not worth the money. The other thing is a the lot better. one. Seems a lot better. But we also like never used the Oogie Bear because I lost it. I don't know what's back here. There's more like the bad thing about these drawers is that they don't come out all the way unless you pick up the drawer. But there's just more like medicine, Tylenol, some. Aquaphor. Aquaphor. Petroleum jelly and just more extra brick water and whatnot. And these are like his like um milestone. Yeah, like numbers. Fun things. And I just restocked the diapers. We have never tried honest diapers. Um they feel yeah. really thin. I don't know how I'm gonna like them, but those are the last of thin. three, so that's why we don't pull it out like that. Alright, we had a little catastrophe, but Soon here we're gonna go for a walk with some laundry in, so we're waiting for that. We're this gonna get the camera first. Got some spit up. We got this mount for his monitor camera, so now we're gonna Where's try to the box figure that out. We just um, hung up, well, Brendan just hung up the camera, and I was looking for our leather pools for the dresser because when the drawer fell, this one knob broke, you probably can't tell, but it's just a little bent down, but yeah. But yeah, also these curtains I got for a deal off of Amazon. I'm on this like savings uh, Facebook group and they were on sale for eight bucks instead of like 40, which is nice. But then of course we had to buy like $40 ones for our bedroom because they weren't on sale. I guess I'll show you guys like a little update around the house. The hallway is so dark and I really wanna fix that. Um, but don't know how. The bedroom is disgusting right now. It's always gross, which is kind of annoying. Um, there's really no updates in here. We hung those curtains last video. They work really well. Um, I'll just put this whole light on. There's really no update in here. My friends from YouTube, Lainey is coming to stay with us. Her and her husband, or they're not married yet. Soon to be husband. And their daughter is coming to stay with us in two weeks. So this will be better. You don't have to sleep on boxes. Um, but yeah, it gives me like two weeks to do that. Which is honestly a long time and 
we've already been here for two weeks so I kind of want to get through it um, but yeah also I organized the hall closet it's just like little, little small touches really help um, but yeah I did like baskets on this side I'll show you that um, I don't think this was in the last video I think it might have been the same day but you know life um it's also kind of really hard to film in here just because it's a small tight hallway and there's no changes in the bathroom but you were in there earlier um there's a lot of changes downstairs so i'll go downstairs um again this is also messy because such is life but we hung these photos up um that's me and finn when he was born that was like my first photo with finn that's Brendan and I for our maternity photos, and then another maternity photos, and Brendan and Finn on Father's Day. I really do, I like that picture a lot. I also really like that both of those photos are like minuscule. I don't know if that makes any sense. Like they're not like in your face photos of Finn, um, which obviously will probably put a lot more photos of Finn around the house, but just those ones are nice because it's just like us and Finn which is cute turn you around this is actually from my grandparents this is a hope chest um, the top opens that piece of like plexiglass next to it was on top of it but I don't really want to use it just because of Finn and more children and blah 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 and then this is the Alex Cubes, not Alex Cubes, Alex drawers. So that's a whole different thing. This is the Calyx thing from Ikea. This is like for Finn's toys. The only two bottom bins are Finn's toys right now. And then there's other stuff that we need to put other places. And then our couch, just pretend that the bottle's not on the floor. Cooper's on the couch right now. And then I hung up this um, photo ledge and this we had in san diego i probably would have wanted like a different color ledge but i still like it um the main thing is from mapiful i did a video with them last september i think and i got that map it's still one of my favorite things because it's like it's the hastings and it's when we got married in san diego and that's like the skyline or the stars above san diego and now there's just a ton of photos I saw this idea on Pinterest. That photo back there is Brendan and Finn and I. And then that book is an engagement book. I don't know if that's gonna stay there, but I think it's cute. And then that back picture's from um, our pregnancy announcement pictures. And then the front photo, that one's also just random. I kinda just threw it up there. I think it looks cute though. I don't know if I'm gonna keep that photo. I might put a picture of Finn, but whatever and then that plan is from ikea i really want to figure out a way to organize better but for now i feel like we're doing pretty well for being here for two weeks um would i love it to be better of course but um for now i feel like it looks pretty good and then in here around again this is our dining area um i think you saw this table last video we got it for free from this site on facebook and then the this is like a, the main attraction of the dining room. I really like it. You know, the 100 boxes of diapers. Um, Target had a deal. Spend $75, get a $15 gift card. And if you are a fan of Huggies or the Costco brand, the overnight up and up diapers for all day round are equivalent to those both brands like Huggies and Costco. And they always have the deal of like spend 75 get a 15 dollar gift card or spend 100 get a 20 dollar gift card regardless they always have a deal and these break down to like five cents less than the costco diapers and a whole lot of less than the huggies diapers don't ask why i know that i'm insane and then the millie moon diapers we've never tried but i wanted to try them so got those kind of pains me that that box is 72 diapers and then these up and up diapers are 76 diapers and that's like three times the price but whatever first time mom gotta try diapers don't know why um i probably could i could have gotten two other up and up diapers boxes for the same price that is from ikea the little like 
I don't know what that would be called, like a hutch, I guess. I think it's like a buffet table, whatever. Um, I really, really like it. It matches our TV stand. I think it's really cute and looks high-end without being a high-end price tag. It's like 250 maybe under 300 whatever. It's under 300 I think. And I think it's really cute and looks really classy. And then these shelves we made, we got them... We got a piece of wood from Lowe's and had them cut it for us and we stained them. Just like pretty much like an off wood color. Um, we have a lot of different wood tones, but I wanted that because eventually we will paint the cabinets of the kitchen. Eventually, don't know why. Um, and then I got these brackets from Amazon. I think they're really, really cute. I wanted a different type, but these were a pack of I want to say eight, because there's six on the wall, um, eight for like 20 bucks, and I couldn't beat that. And the shelves are really, really skinny, which I personally like. I originally wanted to make this like a coffee bar, but there's no outlets on this wall, which is kind of annoying. Eventually, we'll probably, hopefully, put an outlet so that way the top can be like a coffee bar, um, just to free up more counter space over there. But, um, obviously eventually. I still think it's really cute to do light like, decor and blah blah blah. This stuff will not be here. Also, not much changes outside, but, um, this table is from my grandparents and we finally brought it over. I think Cooper is going outside. Um, but yeah. But yeah, I'm about to watch Celeste Rayanne's video. I never know how to say her middle name. I think that's her middle name. I don't think it's her first name. Whatever. Her cozy weekend vlog. And she always, in her videos, she always motivates me because she talks about how in the morning she'll like make breakfast and then she always has to clean her kitchen afterwards because it takes like no more than 10 minutes and she used to like push it off and yada 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 and she has like a whole cleaning routine and everything and I really want to start incorporating that into my life because I just let everything pile up and then just like get overwhelmed with it when in reality it will take like 10 minutes to do but I just continually push it off so yeah, I'm gonna watch your video hopefully get a little bit of like I can't think of the word motivation for um cleaning up the house because I am overwhelmed and really want to clean it well, I don't really want to clean. I really want a clean house, but I don't want to clean. So, yeah, I'm going to watch her video, and then I'm going to hopefully clean, and then we're going to go for a walk. Yeah, I'm going to do a little speed cleaning of the kitchen. Um, right now, I just really need to clean up there, so...
Okay, it is a lot later now. I guess not actually that much later. It's like two hours later and I have been editing for like a while. How long have I been editing? I don't know. Whatever. I've been editing for a long time and um, Finn woke up from his nap as soon as I hit stop recording when I was cleaning. So he has been awake this whole time. And yeah, I am editing the vlog and um, I also made a vlogmas intro. So that's just a huge commitment, but I feel like we could do it. Do you think so? Yeah. It's going to be hard, but I feel like it's worth it for like the memories and everything. And fun. since Lady's coming, I feel like it'd be fun. That's only two days, but still. Um, but yeah, um, I'm excited, I'm nervous that it's going to be so much more work than I think it's going to be, but I think it's going to be fun. And just in time for dinner, our new high chair came. We have the like three in one ingenuity, ingenuity, I don't know, um, high chair and like, it's good. We got it for free. I feel like maybe... It's older than I thought it was, but we got it for free, but the wheels just suck, and we got this new high chair. We got, like, a cheapy one off of Amazon. It's the Graco Slim Stacker. No, Slim Snacker Fast Folding High Chair. Brendan's going to open it on the blog. I'm going to keep editing. Okay, we are ending the vlog here. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know it was kind of like random because there was mostly stuff during the day. But, you know, with a little baby, it's kind of hard to vlog all the time. Um, he is now ready for bed and he is about to go down. Um, we're waiting for his sleep sack to come out of the dryer. Because we only have one. So, how do you feel about doing vlogmas? I don't know. It'd be fun. Do you think we could Give do it? something to do. Yeah. Yeah. I think we're going to do it. We're going to do it. Gonna um, do I think it. we might start vlogging a little bit earlier. So that way at least like I have vlogs and stuff going up on the first. And a couple days maybe we'll start vlogging on Friday. Like by Friday. Maybe and decorate and everything. But yeah. Mm -hmm. We're going to do vlogmas. I hope you guys are excited. excited I'm nervous you? about it. But I think it's going to be excited? fun. Good, 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 good. He's bumpy. Do you think it's going to be fun? Yeah. All right. Well, we will see you guys in our next video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And make sure you subscribe down below so you don't miss vlogmas this year. Do it. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Bye.